Hey, monster dudes, monster girls, humans, I'm back again. Um, anyway, so, it, sorry if my vi sorry if my character is, like, out of sync with the voice right here. It's because my, I have, like, a new camera that actually makes it look like I'm, like, a, like, a, like, 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 some bad 90s dub anime. But, without further ado, let's continue. Let's slow on in. So, Joe Cat. Oh, my snake gods. And here I thought Joe Cat had left the internet back in December of 2023, but I guess not. I guess he's still relevant because it's funny how each month that passes, Joe Cat becomes relevant somehow. Somehow. But here he is back again on June 9th. All the women who I have worked with and hung out over over the years are, are free to share their experience with me. I have nothing to hide. Which is pretty funny though, because so there's a reason why Joe Cat's getting hate, but it's so funny how people are just memeing on him. Has he ever expressed the respect for his hobbies and talent for a real life woman, or is it always porn drawing and video game characters? Me to every woman to Joe Joe Cat has ever interact with in the history of his life. <laughs> All of them stop asking. <laughs> What sounds this kind of gets it. So many content creators celebrate the big names just to turn out to be awful and disappoint you. And you don't know how you can trust and make you cynical. How could it not? Well, then again, you are the same dude that literally kind of joined on that whole cancel culture. But we'll get to that in a bit. I just wanted to show this because it's so funny how people are just memeing on him. And look, there's even, yeah, even this one person said it gets it. Whatever happened to you leaving the internet? I know, because he left, like, he was supposed to leave in December. This is why, wait, then why do you care so much? Exactly! And it's so weird how he's making, like, one little, little detail that he shouldn't care about. A big thing, and yeah, he came back to the internet to say this, which is so weird. But, yeah, he's become, like, relevant and over this stuff. But I find it really hilarious. Even people called him out on this stuff. Um, where is it? There's another one. I, I thought it was so funny. Because somebody actually called him out. It was one of my favorite VTubers. Oh, where is he? I'll probably find him another time. Okay. I just find it funny. Um, even his girlfriend. Yeah, I know it's not girlfriend. His wife, of all people, got involved in this. Okay, so right here. Alright, there we are. This is where I was talking about. Discussion how shift that Joe Cat depicts himself as a safe to hide that he secretly actually wanted to have sex with women. Did I ever try that secret? Just try to make that secret? I thought everyone was mad because I was thought loud about it at the time. Very confusing. I love this right here. Papu Uwu is my favorite, dude. Definitely watch him. Alright. Joe Cat, listen, mate. You need to put a baby in a woman, okay? Being a closet homosexual is is my gimmick. Can't have people drawing more comparisons between us. Take one for the fellow cat, will ya? I'll buy you a beer or a Big Mac. <laughs> I freaking love you, Papa Uwu. You, you, you're freaking amazing. Yeah. Yeah, I can't believe his wife had to make this. Yeah, apparently his wife got involved in this. But that's not the main part I wanted to make this video because I will talk about this. When I, when I see people being mean to my boyfriend online, weirdos on the internet are saying you need to get laid, and I think it might be right. But I'm in the middle of a work day. Don't argue with losers on the internet. My god. It's like, this is like the... Okay, but like, it's so funny because the reason why people are hating on him... Um, not hating on him. The reason why people are mad at him, because he was part of the... The Wind Waker hate bandwagon, as I will show you right here. But, yeah, where is it? Oh, okay, right here. Anyone shining about the harassment is taking the topic comparison and focusing on away from the main issue. Trans people are still in danger. Which, they're not. They're kind of more of a danger to themselves, if anything. Especially the harassment forced by content creators. It is not, nor should it be about us. Content creators are not the same danger as trans people are. Yeah. This is what really pissed off a lot of people to Joe Cat, and this is why people are turning against him on his video too, which is 
which is really pretty wild. How does he manage to be straight while acting gayer than most homosexuals? Yep, right here. The gay agenda. Fuck the gay agenda. It's beyond me, and I don't know why. It's so weird, but... Yeah, but this is so bad that his wife got involved in this. His wife of all people. Okay, right here. As a woman who has spent years up close to the personal with this man, I promise you, he's made a green flag in kindness. Which is pretty stupid because right here, unless you want to stream Hogwarts Legacy, that's a green, the green will quickly turn red. And this is what Eco Gillett had to say to that. His wife. If you support a transphobe, then yeah, the man who has raised $70,000 for a trans charity probably not gonna have you in his friends and family chat, dude. Be for real, which is pretty fucked up, honestly, because that sort of thing caused a lot of people, caused a lot of people to go through a lot of crap, like being doxxed and being harassed. Like Silver Veil, for good example, she got she was crying on stream because of it, and not only that, it caused a VTuber like Pika Me of all people to quit because of people like freaking Echo Gillet kind of endorsing this. Now go fuck yourself, bro. Bro, playing a video game doesn't make you transphobic, exactly. And people are shitting on his wife. His wife is such a fucking Karen, just like that freaking Palestine supporting bitch that I did with that Cyclone video. On that Mike Pollock situation. You and him are green as the sun is blue. <laughs> you care so much about JK, but tweeting this, this on a phone that with with childish child labor. Oh my god. Tweet this on a phone made with child labor. Oh my god. Day ending why. Go back to having sex with Miss Asexual or whatever. <laughs> So donate to a, so he's donated to a bunch of degenerates. Lamau. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Boo, video games. Did I scare you? Guess I'm transphobic. <laughs> it's just like I, it's like I don't understand with these people, like, especially like, do they not understand the harm that they cause to these people? Like, I just wanted to show this because it's insane how people like Joe Cat is still relevant, even though he's gonna leave the internet, but he comes back to being a moron as usual. Just for arguing with some random guy on the internet, which is ridiculous. Seriously, he just he should have just left the internet. That's my opinion. I don't think his video was bad or anything. I just think himself, like having no self-awareness is ridiculous. But that's all I wanted to say. I'm Viperus and I'm out. Like and subscribe. I'll be back again. Laters.